I realise I haven't picked up my camera at all this morning. Um, we've just had one of those mornings. It's just been flap, 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 trying to get everyone out the door. Um, yeah, but it's bloody beautiful today. It's such a nice day. Miles is watching a DVD, if you can hear that in the background. But um, I'm actually heading over the forest because me and Miles are going to the cinema. I actually already pre-booked to go see the new Paw Patrol, of course. I saw a couple weeks ago that they were doing like a premiere of it and I saw like people on Instagram going to see it but sadly locally I couldn't find like any availability in any of my cin cinemas. So um, yeah, we're going to watch it this morning. Um, I booked it for 10.30 and as I mentioned yesterday, um, I'm also going to pop into Primark to get some essentials. I've got like a list of essentials. I went to the kids last night and was like, what do you need? What do we need to get? winter so um yeah we're also going to be doing that right we're in west key part i'm gonna do a couple of shops we're gonna go in here and we need to get some white chocolate for the velvetizer oh and this they are cool aren't they oh, yes. like individual chocolates little Primark. Look at this. <laughs> My helper. Okay, I'm just following you, Miles. I'm not sure about these. A bit short. Look at that, a whole jumpsuit. Interesting. Where are you going? <laughs> Miles. Oh my God. Let's follow our pajama set. That's pretty cute. I mean, Violet wouldn't wear it, but that is adorable. Um, and we've got like, these are so cute. We're not in the boys section yet, as you can see. But, oh yeah, these little, I've got a Violet one of these last year. Got some new ones out. It's pretty. You can on. Christmas dinosaur. Yeah, they're pretty cute, aren't they? Oh, they're so fluffy as well. These are nice as well. Oh. Right, we are done with Primark. I spent £91, but I got all the essentials. And um, yeah, we've just took it back to the car, so now we're going to go watch Paw Patrol. <laughs> Trolls will be out soon. Right, number nine then, Miles, this one. Nobody's here. Nobody's here. I always pick the same suits. And replying. I always sit in the same suits, it's bizarre. Always at the end, because obviously if they need a way, it's easy to kind of get off. Um, yeah, there's literally nobody in here. I think there's someone else coming with a little girl, but I suppose it's like the week before half term and it's a school day. Yep, okay, we are home from Southampton. The movie was really, really good. I would recommend it. Like, it's a really good kids' movie. We watched the first one, it was really good. This one, I think, is better. Um, the only thing I didn't like though, there was 30 minutes of ads before the movie, which I think is far too long for, for like a kid's movie. I don't know why it just kept dragging on. Um, luckily, Miles at four now, he does have quite a good attention span. He had no problem sitting through that and the whole movie. The movie was probably near, near an hour and a half, I reckon. Um, I did bring like a few diff different nibbles and snacks and stuff um, for him to have. But yeah, so I'll show you what we got from Primark though, because I spent £90, but I got some really good essentials and I stocked up a few bits for Alistair as well because he's just had this big growth spurt. Um, I'll show you my hotel chocolate 
stuff. So um, I ordered, not I ordered, I picked up the vanilla white, which is basically the white chocolate, um, hot chocolate. Um, with this, they like they give you the method of like six teaspoons, uh, which I think is too much. Even the sachets themselves, I because you can get individual sachets for the velvetizer. Um, I would say is far too much and the kids never need that much. It's it's very sickly sweet. I always just do like a good sprinkle. This lasts me ages. And we actually still have, we've got the milky one, I think it's 60% milky, and we've got a dark chocolate one as well. So I just got the white chocolate. The kids love it, I love it as well. And then Graham absolutely loves the praline, the hazelnut praline. These are the single sachets. They don't do it as a whole big bag, sadly. But, um, yeah, I got those as well. And from Primark, two big bag fulls. So, starting out, Alistair, joggers. I actually got him two lots of joggers in the men's section, extra small. These are six pounds each, dark grey and black. Um, centrals that he needs over winter. As, as of right now, he's still in shorts and t-shirts, so I don't know when he's gonna transition over, but he everything stays out now in his wardrobe. Um, I also got him this black hoodie. I got it in the large. They didn't. They only had it in the small, which was far too small, and you only had it in the large, so I got it in the large, which doesn't look too bad. It's a bit of an oversized fit, I reckon, but it's not too bad. Um, this was nine pounds. It's just a standard black hoodie. Again, men's section. Um, and then moving on to Miles, some of these things you will see that he cho he chose. So he got, he wanted this Ninjago t-shirt, which I thought was pretty cool. It's quite big though, that's quite big. I did get in the five to six, but that was £6.50. So a little bit on the steeper end of their t-shirts, their long sleeves. I had to go for the Christmas one. I reckon because they like to bring out like their seasonal things quite early and by Christmas this will be gone so this was £2.30 in this like Christmassy print great for nursery again I got the stripey print as well this was £2.30 for a standard stripe as soon as we walked in I got one item for myself because I saw this on the, on the uh, mannequin and I was like I really want that um, this was £15 everything's gone up so much in Primark does anyone else think that, like jumpers and stuff? I swear this sort of knit would probably be, like last year, about £10, maybe £12. But yeah, £15, uh, size medium, and it's just, I like the fact it's got zipper. It's not a too much of a heavy knit, but I love the grey. It's nice and neutral, and it's a nice longer length as well. Um, and then moving on to the other bag, I got Alistair, the zip up hoodie this one I got in the size medium nine pounds um they didn't actually they did this in black but they didn't have the size so um yeah I got him that as again basic staples he doesn't really do color ever um Miles chose these Christmassy pajamas which were four pounds fifty they are a dinosaur soft um fleecy material which he will probably start wearing now you know because he needs pajamas i also got him this two pack um for eight pounds these are like space theme which i thought were really really nice they didn't look too some of them are really garish but that's actually a really nice set it's kind of this really light blue a little bit of gray dark blue and then the kind of space print for the other basic bits that I even went in there for. So Miles chose these Mickey Mouse socks. He was adamant he wanted these socks. They are very, very brightly colored, um, but they're long socks, which is what he needs. So that was seven pairs for five pounds, which I thought was pretty good. And they're a Disney, you know, kind of themed. Um, I also got him some more neutral ones, five pairs for four pounds, and they're more like woodland stars um yeah a bit more muted than the brightly colored ones but still super super cute again long socks so he's got 10 pairs of new socks much needed i got violet these fluffy socks this one is going to go away as it's a christmas socks these were one pound 30 um this is going to go away as like a stocking filler i'm 
I'm definitely buying stocking fillers now. Um, yeah, and they're just like a star print and they've got the um, little rubber bits on the bottom as well, which is really good. And then I also got her these for now. She loves fluffy socks like me. Um, these little avocado ones and the stripy pink. This pack of two was £2.80, which I thought was pretty good. And then also I got her these pairs of socks, five pairs of £4, which I thought were really nice. They're kind of like, you know, muted, but kind of designed. I thought they were quite nice as long socks, obviously not for school. Um, and then also two pairs of opaque tights. I said to her in the car this morning, I was like, you need tights. She has, and she hates tights, but I was like, you really need tights. If you don't want to wear trousers to school and you're going to wear skirts, you really, really need something on those bare legs. Um, so she said, okay. So we tried these, age 11 to 12 and 13 to 14. The opaque 40 denier, £2.80 a pack for three in each, which I thought were quite good. Um, she said she didn't want them to be super thick, so I think that'll be all right. And that was everything, everything I got. Alistair does not need socks. He actually has backup socks already. And um, yeah, I think I, I got the essentials that I needed. I don't think I didn't get anything that I was still kind of after. I got gloves. Oh, did I show you the gloves? Where did I get the gloves? Oh yeah, I've got Miles two, two lots of gloves because apparently the kids don't need gloves. They're a pound a pack. Again, these used to come as a set of two for a pound. So yeah, they no longer do that, which is a bit annoying. But um, yeah, they're kind of one size ones, so they should be okay. Um, but that's, they didn't really have much apart from like themed ones, but he's only gonna be wearing some nursery, one pair of nursery, one at home. So yeah, that's everything I got from Primark. Now I'm gonna put it all away. I've got to show you this jumper, because it's really, really nice. See, it's just like, it's got like a little split. I really like the, the collar, just nice, I like it. You see, it's got like this little knit detail in as well. But I do like the collar, I think that's what sold it. It's just a little bit different, just to your standard jumper. Right, I am just out walking the dogs before it gets dark. Graham's coat on. <laughs> Honestly, this is like dog walking attire. Um, I've actually had a really kind of mitt afternoon, you know, you just, I just had a bit of a belly ache all day. Thank you, time of the month. I've just, oh, I've just felt really uncomfortable, a bit moody, and um, yeah, I've just wanted and been kind of waiting for Graham to come home just to take over, basically, you know. You, know, you just have one of those days where you just, I'm kind of done. I felt like I was done by school run. I was like, I'm so done with the day. And yeah, he's just been doing, you know, bath and sorting miles out for bed. So yeah, just to give me a bit of a breather. But um, yeah, we're just gonna chill. Chill tonight, much needed, catch up on something and I will see you bright and early for yet another school and I'm working tomorrow as well.